How unfindable the plane would have been without the GPS. Here's a lake I was flying on, and it went down right over. And zoom in by those dead trees right there. Let's see if it'll focus here. Just to the left of that cell phone tower, probably oh a good thousand feet from here. And it's all swamp. And that as you saw how thick that brush is. There's no way. Even marking it to the left of that tree once I got over there, there was no way to figure out where I was. One may ask what the uh, value of a GPS is uh, in like something like The Apprentice. Well, here's one value. I just got the plane back. I'm going to show you just how remotely located this thing is. Here's it at ground zero. The GPS got me within 10 feet of it. And then I found it in the jungle canopy, if you will, in Wisconsin here. And there it is. Float plane is right up there. Probably would have never, never would have found this thing without the GPS. You can hear the uh, battery or the stuff still going on. So I've got my uh, my cutter here, and I'm going to cut the thing down. But this is a example of a GPS finding a lost airplane. So I just looked at. The, I'll show the GPS track I had on it. Oh, have it down. Doesn't look too worse for the wear. Little aileron. I should say there's an elevator that's got to be replaced, but it's no big deal. Got more of those and took the battery cover off and took the battery out, but everything else looks like it's fine. Challenge will be getting everything out of here, but at least I got it back, all the servos and stuff.